Hey kids, we're back here on Asylum, and that's Scully, and I'm waiting on a Skype call. And that, way up there... And that would be Scully in the way of my... You just blocked... You called just as I was doing something, and now I have a great big wad of Skype in my recording window. <laughs> Yeah, that's you, just, you were just recording? I just started. Uh, let me turn my sound down here. It's doing my cookie thing. And shooting at your cameraman. <laughs> Let's see if this works. I gotta move him though, he's not in a good spot. If you want him down, I can get him down. <laughs> I gotta get rid of this giant tower to steal from something else. No, no, just give him some cobble and have him dig over and. He has no tools or anything, I gotta give him all, all kinds of stuff. <clears throat> what kind of operation is this? Yeah, it's, it's first time I'm doing this. This kind of thing. It'll be cool when it's done, though, to time lapse the whole thing. You know? That'd be pretty cool. Just the fun part of running Bandicam, Skype, and Minecraft at the same time. You, this computer. Yeah, you'd think 16 gigs of RAM would mean something. Wow. I don't know what else I'm running. S Steam is shut off. Let me uh, mute you guys for a sec so I can. Uh, Who else is on? Uh, well, I know Birdie's here. I don't know if he's going to join. I was going to mute you for a sec so I can do some yappa yappa talking away here. Go ahead, go ahead. Of course, you're going to hear me sit here and yap away too. That's not going to help much, is it? Yeah, so you're just going to have to hear me yap. I'm not sure how to, uh... Oh, uh, yeah, if you don't mind. There we are. I just had to hang up for a minute. So, like every server, we need an arena. Which technically winds up being a stupidly large project. Uh... I want to build an asylum. Now that I look, oh, not asylum. Back on Insomnia it wasn't bad. It wasn't great, mind you. It wasn't bad. But there's a lot of things I wish I could have added in that I didn't even know about. Go away. Seriously. Thank you. But this time, we locked into a uh, something nice. We're just outside of spawn, and there's a, there's a zombie spawner out here. So we're going to basically build the entire arena right over top of it. Now, if I come down here, and I take a lever, and I shut that torch off somehow. Yes. No, a lever, not a torch. This. Like Click. Nope, why does that not work? Oh, I know why. Because I'm dumb. Oh, let's pop the torch out. There we are. That shuts off all these lights. Spawner turns on. It's going to get kind of dangerous here for... Well, it's the middle of the night. How much more dangerous can it get? All right. These guys get pushed along. So they finish that one. Get carried up onto the... Uh, these platforms up here. And I better turn this thing back on before things get really bad. Uh, that. Let me get myself back up here. Do, 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 do. Up here. <clears throat> you can see, got a couple of zomberts flopping around in here. This uh, this setup was 
what I could come up with as a way to randomize where the zombies wind up. So they don't all just pile up in one door, right? Which wouldn't be bad, but then you have to... If you want to, you know, fight a big herd of zombies, it's kind of lame when you know exactly which door they're coming up. This way it kind of spreads them out, so you might have more in one, less in another. This setup here, eh, that was smart of me. Back up here. This, if I can get over here. It's a setup for the pistons. Okay, so I hit this, right there. Pistons go up. And, ouch! Really? In the middle of something. Get lost. Becomes string. Puts this gate up. There's not two blocks of space here, so the zombies can't get out. And they can just pile up behind there. Because uh, this won't be there. Right? So they can stand there, but they can't do anything else. Uh, I thought about having to come in from the top. I might still do that, but I need to carry the signal up. And I didn't bring the redstone with me to really think that part through. But at least this way, when the gates come down, all these zombies can come up. So I'm just gonna... I'm gonna lost my spray foam. There it is. Can I reach you? There we go. Close this again, and baby zombie. Okay, kid. Seriously. Where did you wind up? Okay, I don't know where he went. There, we lost. These gates are going to run off of two different inputs. The, uh... The lights for the spawner, and all of this are all going to run up to a control room. Which will probably be... blown up by creepers. Well, that was great accuracy. In the face. Be a control room probably above that bay, and... Okay, really, guys? Get lost. Be uh, there's actually going to be a number of switches up there, <coughs> but from right up directly atop here, you'll be able to shut the spawner lights on and off so they can stuff can spawn and things can pile up. There'll be a switch that turns these gates from uh, okay, get lost. It turns these gates from uh, being controlled. Well, you throw them all open, or there'll be a lever that uh, runs to a set of repeaters, and they'll open like one, two, three, four in sequence. So depending on how many you have, you instead of having them come at you from all sides, you can kind of control which way they're going to happen. Uh, I'm still trying to figure out if I want to add something that lets a player shut them off from this side. As in, uh, run up, hit a button. That would probably lift... I'm not sure I'd be able to do this. What do I got here? Nothing. Yeah, I could do that. You could put a sticky piston here. Right? Of course I have no levers to make one. You and you become that. Is it? Really, kid? Really? Die. So when you hit a button, this would come up, and it would, uh... Nope, you have to hit a button. Hmm. Gotta think about this. Because what you, if this went up here, you'd never be able to, sh you'd never be able to shut the gates, right? You'd never be able to get a redstone signal to uh, through there. Or could you? Let's try something silly here. If anything, I'm always up for something silly. This, like, nope, this is gonna work. I can tell already. This would come down and cut that. Right over here. I would never have anything. How many more levers can I make today?
How many times can I misplace things? Give me this lever, seriously. No, I don't want the cobble, I don't want this. Give me that. Away with you! So with this down, that signal can't get through, but with that up, signal can. Okay. I would still be able to run a signal that way through it. Yeah. One more so if I do that, and I run that to a... Need a lever here, I think. I went to it. Yeah, lever. If I put this lever get up here, get that. This lever here, and then come across like so. Uh, I'll do this. Drop a signal there. This and like that. Yeah, that would work. So if the master switch was on for all the uh, all the gates, which would be this guy. Get back up here. Hey, Scout, what's up? We do this. It should prove that I know nothing about redstone. Sigh. Okay, what's me doing wrong here? We get power to this guy, right? So I need to go like this. Redstone is so much fun. I love it. Best part of the game ever. Hands down. Best thing ever. Let's try this. The lever. Okay, so as long as this is. What do I do here? Put that down. What am I doing wrong here? Oh, I know why. I got two different signals going. Uh, give me a sec. Okay, got it figured out. I had an extra piece, uh, that other line I put in it was messing things up. So right now, a guy from right here. Turn these gates on and off. Yeah. Uh, comedy of errors. But yeah, that's uh Yeah that works. Holy crap. I don't know what it is. Sixteen gigs of RAM. Sixteen friggin' gigs of RAM. I run three things in my game. I can barely play this game. I don't get it. But right here, a player would be able to open and close these gates. I'm going to get Scully back on the call here. Uh, you, need to use both, you need to use the same account, though, right? You got to jump on the other server. Yeah. But I needed, I needed to figure this out for myself, otherwise I wouldn't know how I was going to do it. <laughs> you do it three more times. Oy. Well, <laughs> the, so the idea is that this here, this lets a player open and close these. So if we had, uh, uh... Yeah, I mean... Otherwise, we'd have to do some kind of randomizer or some more complicated to, uh, redstone stuff, so... Well, this is for... We don't need to do that. No. But what this does, and I just got done yapping away in, uh, to myself about it, was that if the, the master control up in the... where our control room's gonna be... So that, if... This is on, and that's down. Gates are up. That shuts it off, right? <laughs> yeah, I got. I did that a whole bunch of times myself. Right, gates are down. Okay, so if I turn, maybe the control control room switch, and then that. And any zombies that any zombies that spawn can come right on up. Right. Right. So this would mean that you'd have to fight your way past a bunch of these stupid things to get over here to shut that off. Right. 
I'm not sure how much of a wonderful feature that's going to be, but I imagine someone's going to knock that uh, lever off the wall the first time we do something. Um. I could probably put it up higher. Maybe on top would be better. <coughs> put a full block there. Oh, care crumble. So, uh, it's a little later on in the day. Got a bit work, not much, nothing of any real value. Still trying to figure out how to do all the wiring, but we had a little death games action. And it became apparent that, um, this stuff... Over here, it's over here, isn't it? Oh, target. Looks like... Eh, not on right now. The, uh, the death game stuff is just... Just not up to it. I'm not gonna say who, because I'm pretty sure they recorded. They came after me with this stuff. Death, Pro 1, Sharpness 1, Power 1. This stuff did, uh... Both two hearts damage to me. Granted, he had the uh, he had the advantage of surprise. Uh, probably should have grabbed a potion or two, but I'm sure he'll explain what happened. But we're uh, we're gonna step it up a notch here. So instead of playing with a cap, ding. playing old pro one, playing old pro one, playing old pro one. I mean, they're all named so people can repair them. This poor old thing here. Duh. And this bow of destiny. With this bow of destiny. I think this is going to give a guy a much, uh, a much better chance compared to before. Uh -huh, what I think I might do is... I will do. <coughs> yep, something got creepered. Feel free to fix stuff, guys. Anytime. Uh, come on. I think this is the only, uh... The only sword that's been used so far. And while it has been used to some effect... Uh, on the roof. So we lift it all up. <coughs> My mistake we did. Scrab. Thirty levels, eh? Yeah, awesome. So let's I built this and I can't find my way into it. Well, helped build this thing. You. Yes. Two. Yeah, that's good enough. I'm gonna make a couple item frames. So the old uh, Sword of Destiny still gets to do something. By well, my luck, there's no wood here, right? Okay, really? I gotta figure out what's screwing with my uh, with my recording here. Dirt, dirt. Can you meat wads keep any wood around here for crying out loud? Relax, on it. So cut something down. You are not in a good spot. I don't have a lead. And someone went and put the, uh... uh let's see... Boing! <coughs> Where can we put you? Because you're just going to wander away the moment you do anything else. Can't ride you into the building, because... You know what, maybe I can. Let's find out. Two and a half there. There. You'll be safe here now. I don't know who I don't know who you belong to. Let's go cut down. Let's cut them down. I don't know why I did that. There's one right over there. And some sticks. Take the 
this guy here. There's no confusion. Upgrade games, gear, and chest. Here you are, so a little sword and bow. Still serving some function. Hopefully these guys will work a little bit better than uh all of these guys. Don't know what to do with them. I know. Uh, we'll put them in spawn. Set a building here. In case someone needs some emergency armor. Over here. Do, 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 do. Nope, my state. What more did I get done anyway? Oh yeah, that's right. Next to nothing. <laughs> Throw a bit more obsidian on the floor. But other than that, nothing really. That's uh, Scully's... Got a cameraman account. Hopefully it'll look down. One day when we get a whole bunch of building done, we'll, I think he intends to do a time lapse. We didn't get much else done, did I? So... Still need to figure out exactly how to wire all this stuff up. It's got to come all back here, and then it's going to have to go up to a control room up here. Up there. We're still going to need... It's not the best place to go. Need a bunch of blocks down here. We're going to fill this all in. Well, fill it in, but break it in. For storage, for... You know, decorations. I've messed something up. This is different from that one. Dang it. I'll have to figure out what. Because I'm not quite totally sold on a design yet. The area down here will be for, uh, is it for storage? We'll probably get a bunch of. Hmm. Here's some cows or something. I don't know. Scully wants to do some uh, villager things. And I think over here is probably where we're going to set him up. This will be a big enough building that we can control all the spawns in it, and hopefully it'll get enough use. Um, like with us, there'd be in there. And if we pump up all the trades enough, that other people can use them to get uh, more toys. I gotta admit, villager trading's fun. Uh, not use uh, uh because it's flipping raining. <laughs> yeah, but uh it'd be a good place to get a bunch of villagers, a nice place we can build up uh get out of my thing here. Once it's all completely built, we'll uh swap out a bunch of the bricks for some of the nice deco stuff, cracked stone. That kind of things. Uh, we've got an ender farm on the build. Not quite sure where it. Uh, I'm not sure how long that's going to take. The guy building it hasn't built one before. So, uh, <laughs> I'll admit it, I've never built one before either. So I don't know. Uh, I honestly don't know what kind of undertaking it is. I've watched other people build stuff. It's what did you say? Oh, really, dude? Really? Don't get out of bed, otherwise... Someone stole a bed. Oh, wait, yeah, I know what happened. So... Hmm, that's not the safest way to get out of that one. So, someone, I'm not going to say who, can't shut the damn doors. Another creeper in it. Apparently it went off over here. This had a sign on it. What 
was a sign there, I think. And these things wouldn't happen if people would learn to shut the dang doors. You get born in a barn? Look at primates. Yeesh. Yep, doesn't definitely went off. Blew the clock off the wall. I wonder where it went. Probably into someone's inventory. Which is unfortunate, because that was actually... That was the first clock someone built on this server. Hmm. That kind of had a bit of a sentimental value. What happened to it? Oh, well, it was someone. I feel bad putting that one there, though. It's not the same. Here, get off. We'll have to figure out who wound up with the clock. But that'll be a mystery for later. I'm gonna stop bothering you guys. Talk to you later.